Bazox e-commerce sales portal allows salespeople internally and externally, customer service, as well as call center employees to place orders and serve customers online through a web environment. This portal, seamlessly linked in the Dynamics GP database, allows us to obtain information out of Dynamics easily, all with access through a website. Coming onto the portal, you're able to quickly search and find the customer you're looking to service. With this simple drop down, we're able to look up a customer by whatever information we might know about this user. Querying the Dynamics database, we're able to select a customer we'd like to service today, being kicked into an environment as that customer. With sales admin rights, I now have the ability to pull up any previous document history or item history, quickly reorder for a customer a previous order that he might have purchased, check the status of outstanding orders, print invoices, as well as pay off outstanding invoices all online without needing access to the Dynamics database directly. Adding items to a shopping cart is, is quick and easy by simply coming through a hierarchy or adding inventory off an old sales order back into the shopping cart. Price override is a, a feature commonly used on the sales portal environment that allows me to come in here as a salesperson or customer service person and gain insight into other price levels that might be available within the Dynamics database for this particular inventory item. At this point, I have the ability to view those price levels as well as calculate a margin or just do a straight price override, giving me more flexibility as I proceed and place orders for these customers. Having visibility of many inventory items as well as price levels for these inventory is important for a salesperson or a customer service person so I can quickly service my customer as well as recommend other items that might be available or currently in stock. Drilling down and getting more detailed product information is important as well so I can quickly inform a customer of specific information about this inventory item, adding that item to my shopping cart, as well as being prompted for an upsell cross-sell component as well. Checking out on the ASOX sales portal is quick and easy, allowing me to create quotes as well as orders on our web environment. Quotes would be created, converted, and put right in the Dynamics database directly. All the information such as the build to and ship to information is pulled out of the Dynamics database. Multiple locations would be shown. Real-time shipping rate calculations can be selected as well. PO numbers can also be collected. Maybe some delivery instructions on the particular order. We have a verification page to show us what we've purchased, where it's being billed to and shipped to, as well as the shipping and tax that has been calculated from the tax tables within Dynamics GP. At checkout, allowing me to pay with whatever payment options we might have enabled. Again, payment options coming off the customer card for this particular user, in this case Aaron Fitz, um, has the option to pay with Net30 or some credit card terms as well. Finishing the order, this order is seamlessly put in the Dynamics database, sending a notification out to the customer as well as the sales rep who's placed this order. Inventory can be allocated at the time the order is placed.
return credits, debits, invoices, as well as go out there and pay off outstanding invoices online dynamically. 